Hello and welcome to this review for Transformers Rise of the Beasts Titan Changers Scourge. Now this toy uh, was just released in Canada. It is actually part of Wave 2. Wave 1 seems to have been skipped for now. Uh, the, only new, the only new toy in Wave 1 was Cheetor and the only new toy in Wave 2 is Scourge. Uh, repacked with uh, Cheetor and another one from Wave 1. So I've got just if you're curious about the box, because, I mean, the box is, is what was quite interesting for Megatron Wave 1, because you got to see art that you never saw before. Uh, if you're curious, the, this is the art on the Scourge box, and it goes all around. Well, I mean, to the side. And there it is in the back. I'm going to take that away. So this is the kind of toy that transforms into, into uh, a truck very quickly in four steps. As you can tell, he's very, very big. He is taller than leader class. Uh, and is only around like the $15 or $20 price point, depending on your currency. In Canada, he is $22 at Walmart in Canadian currency. I'm not exactly sure how it is in US. Somewhere between 15 and 20 bucks. So just to show you, first of all, how tall he is. So bigger than leader class, of course, compared to uh, a Voyager. I picked Voyager from uh, a decade ago. So like what people would call a real Voyager. And, uh, and there is a deluxe class there. Scourge. I'm gonna get rid of these guys. And I will just transform in case you know a parent just wants to see exactly how it's done. Because this is a toy that will be for kids. So just show exactly what you're uh, getting into with this toy. So I'll bring some I'll bring them closer for some details. Uh, let's see. Here he is. So yes, he's got that MF Doom type mask on. And uh of the ones that I've played with, uh, I this one I would not recommend. I recommend more Cheetor. Uh, it looks a bit better. For example, what I don't find fun here is that the arms are very restricted. He cannot hold any kind of weapon. And it just doesn't look good since you have that whole front part that is the front of the truck. It just, it's just not a good look. And yeah, from the back, if you're curious, it looks like this. There's the truck. Now, uh, to transform it, there's just four steps. First step to do is you have to bring down the head, like so, and then this whole section will fold onto itself, like so. I will bring down the camera so we can continue it here. Yeah, he just flattens up on the floor. Okay. Now, as you can see, these pieces will connect into here. So that's the next step to do. Just be careful that this part is under the top of the truck. So you see it has a tendency to... to go over, you have to make it go under. And you can see it's basically done. The last little step to do is you have to just put these pegs in the holes on the side. And he's done. This is your Scourge in truck mode. Now, uh, the front detail is actually really nice. I'll, I'll give you a close-up so you can see it. You can see that he actually does have, you know, that he puts badges of, you know, what he's destroyed or what he's taken here. Um, and there seems to be a, uh, like an, like a Predacon symbol from, from uh, the, um, uh, the Prime series here. I don't know if you can see that. Maybe not, it's not obvious, but that's what I think it is. Uh, there's a Terracon symbol, I believe, and a Autobot symbol. There's other ones here, I, I don't know, I can't really tell too well. But yeah, but that, that is nice detail. Uh, very well painted, and lots of paint here in the front. Uh, but I mean, I don't know if it's, if it's your jam. Like I said, I don't really recommend this toy since uh, I don't... The transformation, as you saw, is not, not, not too phenomenal. Uh, the... the Alt mode, yeah, he is still, there are still his legs right there. Um, I, I'm not too fond of this toy compared to, let's say, others. Like, for example, I did like the Megatron that did come out. Uh, Optimus was fine, and the Cheetor uh, is very good too. Uh, if you need a bad guy, I guess you could go for this guy. But uh, if you just want a Transformer toy for this price range, I'd go for Cheetor or any of the others. That's just my opinion. All right, take care all. Bye.